welcome to this lesson. In this lesson, we would get some random lowercase characters from the random character class. Then we would we would write it fifteen lines, fifteen on a line. We write fifteen on a line. Then we move to the other line until we are done with all the hundred characters that we want i realized that get random lowercase letter is a very long word so we can replace that with just jl so we are important from random character and we are specifically important get random lower case letter but we are making um another name we are giving it a nickname of jl so that anytime we call jl it would be the same as get random lowercase letter because that is a very long word okay so let's start this is the test method start for the beginning the loop for x in range 100 so this one doesn't take any starting value it would assume a starting value of zero and you move to the last value it's almost rich so it go to 99 or start from zero to 99 that makes it 100 characters 100 random characters so for x in range of that, we will use the if statement to see if we have come to the, uh, the 15th character that we move on the next line for the 16th. And so is the 31st and all that. So if x plus 1. modulus is equal to zero uh modulus 15 is equal to zero now we are adding one to this because the counting start from zero so it goes from zero so by the time it has printed 15 numbers it would be the x would be 14 because it started from zero instead of one so we add one to it so that i start from one two three four five then when it gets to 15 it's actually 15 and not from zero to 14 okay so if x is actually in value as 15 we would want to print on the next line so we print jl jl is a method so we ended with this quotes all right else we would want to stack it together on the same line so use the print jl then if we this is optional if you want one character space between all the random characters then you can place in this so the only thing that changes the whole thing is to use and with the quotes and is called to the quote all right so this is what happens the range comes here it takes whether the number is a multiple of 15 if it's not a multiple of 15 it keeps printing on the same line here until it gets to 15 then it will print on a different line then now the next number has become 16 according to this test then it would keep printing on the same line again until it gets to 30 which is a multiple of 15 it prints on another line on and on till 
we exhausted with uh, we exhaust all the 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 characters you are looking for that is from from zero to hundred okay so thanks for your time this is the end of the lesson